stops. As soon as I'm here. Hello? Wait. Oh, that was aggressive. Oh, I was like, whose hand is that? Nice washer dryer hookups. Ah! There's a person in there. I thought that was something else too. <laughs> Just walk. Dude, sprint out of there. What are you doing? <laughs> I'm getting so annoyed right now. Hello, best friends. We're fun for AJ. And today we are back with another scary video. It's by the channel Sir Spooks and it's called Nine Scary Videos That Will Shock You. <laughs> so you know what to do. Grab your popcorn, get comfy, and enjoy the show. I recently released Ooh, the first episode like of a new series on my second channel, oh, okay. Spooky Hour. The series is called Obscure Mysteries and will feature in-depth, deep dives into unsolved mysteries that I can guarantee you've never heard of before. Speaking of new series, we have one coming up next week. Keep an eye out. We'll leave announcements as we get closer. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button and that notification bell so you don't miss out. Also, be sure to subscribe to my second channel, Spooky Hour, so you'll be notified of new episodes. Hello everyone, uh. my name is Sir Spooks, and today we'll take a look at 9 scary videos. But before we begin, Sorry, make sure them? to subscribe to my channel for more Face. scary content. The woods, the following of course. videos we're going to take a look at come to us from a TikTok user known as the Unknown RGV. In the first video, the uploader explains that him and a friend were told by many people to use the Rando Nautica app oh. for a video idea. Oh, we haven't For heard those who are in a while. The Rando yeah. Nautica app allows the user to explore their local environment and report on their discoveries it? by generating coordinates at random. Or know anyone the app's that does. developers claim that it is an attractor of strange things. The TikTok user and his friend were given a random location located in McAllen, Texas. Upon arriving there, they Not noticed far. that the app had taken them to a random field that was 20 minutes away. Okay. The two That's approached a dead end, but continued yeah. exploring nevertheless. Where did they live then, in? out of nowhere. <laughs> oh, there's someone running? No. Oh, what, what the heck? Can you lower your mic? Come on up for it, What is that, though? What is that? Why is someone running? No, lower it down, lower it down. Oh, Why would you lower it down? You can stop. What's going on? Dude, nah. That, bro. There's someone running. Bro. <laughs> oh, geez, just run. Dude, that's just too fast. Though. There is fa it's fast, right? Yes. Why would you tell nowhere, them to lower down the window? Like, get out of my car. You have darkness, to see it. And no. Seemingly coming out of nowhere before vanishing into thin air. Thank goodness for Obviously, child lock. <laughs> in a second video that was posted by the uploader, oh, he shows video. the exact spot in which the figure was running. Okay. Just so people could get a better sense of their surroundings during the first video. Oh, you guys outside? Wait, why are they there at night again? When you go during the day? Okay, this is where it was running. That's where it was running. Ain't no way, dog. What? This is where it was running the whole time. First of all, <laughs> I would not be in an open field. Yeah, that's crazy. I, I don't know what to think about this because is it true that this app really does take you and then so many people actually see something? I know that's that briefcase. Kid. Yeah, I don't know. What do you guys have? You guys heard it by anyone using it personally and it, uh, actually saw something? I wouldn't want to meet that person. Like the Old beginning of TikTok, a Halloween. A man named Marshall <laughs> posted a video to his account in which he says that he just got back inside from helping his daughter board the school bus in the morning. Okay. When he entered his house and heard some strange noises coming from somewhere inside. What? Despite the fact that he's supposed to be home alone. Almost oh as soon as he says this, the noise in question can be heard pretty well, which is coming from the basement stairs. Have a listen and see what you think about the is eerie noise. This is his first encounter, though. I was putting my daughter on the bus, and I came in. Nobody else is here, and I'm hearing something on our basement stair. There, right there. I'm gonna check it out. What? It's real. Stuck. Do you really think that a lot of people's first instinct is to check it out, or do you think it's to call the police? Actually, yeah. Would you pull out your phone? I mean, you want evidence, but would you, at that instance, your first reaction is to pull out your phone? You already have evidence. Something's knocking on the door. 
Just record it at a safe distance. I'm, I'm just, I'm just wondering. I'm not saying anything, but I'm just kind of like, my first instinct would probably be to call the cops. Like get out of the house, right? Yeah, but okay. I don't know. Yeah, I don't what, know. What either. do you guys think? What would yeah. you do? Yeah, I want to know. Would you pull out your phone to record at that instance, or would you call someone first? Hello. Sounds like the stair. Oh my gosh. In a second video that was posted, Marshall can be seen oh. reacting to the sounds that are coming from the basement stairway once again. But this time, something... Yeah, someone commented, if it knocks, don't open the door. We always say that, right? Because he doesn't invite them in. Yeah. Oh my gosh. It really does sound like they're trying to come in. Yeah. Of course it stops. As soon as I'm here. Hello? Hello? Wait. Oh, that was aggressive. Marshall also mentioned in the description of one of his videos that he lives near an old cemetery uh, and believes that maybe the house is haunted by one of the deceased. That old school is near a cemetery. Did I tell you that? Did you ever see anything? No, not that I know this. It was always there during the daytime, but... Ugh, kind of creepy. I don't know. They said that one clown motel is haunted by the nearby cemetery too, right? Yeah. I wonder about this. Um, if this is true, that lives near a cemetery. Is this the first time he noticed something though? They say ghosts travel in straight lines too. I heard that before. Yeah. Is that true? The Notice following no. eerie video was posted to the popular ghost tour in San Francisco. By <laughs> known as the Last Samurai 69. Who filmed the video in London, England? Quote I saw this object moving across the moon, beautiful orangey moon, last night. I can tell you it was exactly 2306. Apart from being flabbergasted at the moon's beauty, I couldn't believe there was a long object moving very slowly from left to right. Has anyone seen anything like this before? And can someone help me find an explanation, please? I posted on the London subreddit, but I'm not sure we found any explanations." End quote. He then like edited the statement a little bit later on, stating that, quote, I don't think it's a stationary object. The moon is moving from left to right in this video, therefore if the object is stationary, then it would go from right to left in this video, which it doesn't. I also thought of an arch of balloons that may have escaped a wedding, but this object doesn't move that much in terms of bending. So far, nobody in the comments seems to be 100% certain what's going really? on in the video. They usually either. have something. But there are quite a few people that believe Jeez. that the object is none <laughs> other than a UFO. One commenter said, quote, Perhaps a distant contrail segment silhouetted against the moon. End quote. It looks like a tear in the fabric of space and time. What do you guys think it is? A home real estate agent assists clients in buying, selling, and renting residential haunted properties. House. They often also will walk potential buyers through the house like in question so they can get a good idea of what the home Those will are look cool. like. But the reasons, insidious house? Sure you can expect. <laughs> the following video was posted to TikTok by user known as vtaylor72. As the agent walks through the house, it's clear that the place looks quite nice and very cozy. However, it seems as though there may be someone else there who think it's cozy as well. What? Watch this. Squatter? Oh, I was like, whose hand is that? Nice washer dryer hookups. Yeah, oh, cool. I'm oh, sorry I kicked you. Ah! There's a person in there. Oh, it is a squatter. That's scary. As the TikToker opens up one of the closets in the apartment, she's shocked to find a man who seems to be sleeping inside. She calls out loud that there's a person in the closet, much to the surprise of the agent. The video ends a couple of seconds later, making us all wonder what could have possibly happened next. That's terrifying, a squatter. Or what if it was an uh, actual, like, dead body? I just think that would have smelled. <laughs> Look fresh. <laughs> what if that was 
was a this real estate agent's assistant. The paranormal encounter subreddit. <laughs> They're taking and was a nap. By user named Flying Builder. The video in question is a nine second long piece of security camera footage that was recorded in what appears to be the living room or bedroom of the homeowner's house in the middle of the night. Instantly, it's clear that there's something strange going on inside this room. Wait, is that? An extremely strange the dog look at the camera around you can do something about this <laughs> while a dog can be heard barking at it angrily as soon Crazy. as it turns its head and notices it as well unlike a lot of orb videos that you'll see scattered throughout the internet this one is legitimately creepy and doesn't look like something that could be easily explained away such as dust or insects it's also worth noting that the dog barks at it angrily Meaning that there's definitely something of interest here. Floating frisbee. It looks... It doesn't look like it's, uh... There, though. It doesn't look like it's post... Uh, is that in post? Mm -hmm. Over on TikTok, a user known as Likitiu Fabri posted a video to his account in which himself and a friend are shown playing some video games late at night simply trying to enjoy the evening together oh the two can be seen familiar. smiling yeah. and having fun but in just a couple of seconds those smiles are going to noticeably disappear uh oh the fridge that's great how do you hear that though <laughs> He's like, whatever. <laughs> hey, he, he even go check Out it. of nowhere, the dog oh, no, opens gonna go all bad. by itself. Yeah. Something that the one guy notices and is visibly freaked out by. However, the guy is able to brush it off after a few seconds and continues playing the game with his friend. At around the one minute mark, the guys stand up and it's here in which things once again get spooky. Oh! What? As you can see, <laughs> one of the chairs in the room randomly moves all by itself, much to the horror of the two friends. The two stand there in complete shock for a few yeah. seconds before the video eventually ends. Wait, so there's no follow-up? I want to know what happened after that. And again, uh, what was the backstory? What? Okay. UFO. The next video we'll be taking a look at is sure to blow your mind. It was posted to the UFO subreddit by user known as Sleepy Joe 2024 and showcases some truly fascinating footage of what appears to be a flying saucer caught on thermal camera. Hmm. The 34 second video is quite an interesting watch, mainly because we don't usually get to see UFO sighting videos on the internet that were filmed with a thermal camera. Whoa. No f way. The way it moves. Yeah. Holy sh! Holy! That's man. I don't know. The way it moves is crazy. Yeah. One commenter said the object moved as if aliens were moving it around <laughs> like a mouse cursor on a Hilarious. cosmic screen. Others seem to agree that that could actually be what's going on in the video. Sadly, because there isn't a whole lot of context that was provided with the footage by the uploader, there, is. there aren't a bunch of things to speculate about. I believe in aliens, but uh, how can we never really actually see real proof? You want to? Did you not because... remember what happened in the fourth <laughs> kind? I don't I'm, I'm just know. Saying. I'm good. Leave it alone. <laughs> Because you see these videos and it's compelling, but then you don't see anything after that. Leave it alone. Stop asking for this <laughs> stuff. Oh, 
gray. Oh, For some gosh. reason, the guys in this next YouTube video that we'll be taking a look at randomly decides to get the idea to drop a GoPro camera down a mysterious pipe that they stumble across. Little did they know that in doing so, they would end up capturing one of the most terrifying uh, noises that you will hear in quite Gross. a while. Have a listen and see what you can hear. A spider! Uh. Let's do one of the descent creatures. Yeah. What if their GoPro just drops? This descent. I don't know. But did they lose the GoPro? How did they post uh. this? <laughs> I give you one thing. This is a safer way to go. It's just on the floor. What is that? I want to know. Okay. <laughs> I'm getting dizzy. <laughs> Imagine cleaning your camera after As that. the camera slowly <laughs> inches its way down the pipe, it's what clear that the there's snail? something incredibly creepy down there that is growling or making some kind of a heavy breathing noise. It's because they didn't go at all. Yep. What if they edit it in post? I was thinking that too. A woman <laughs> on YouTube know. known as D has a channel called D's Dark Adventures, in which she posts videos of herself exploring some freaky places and discovering some truly dark and twisted places. By herself? In this video that was posted to her channel in June of 2024, Dee heads out to the woods in Ohio, where she no. finds a strange trail that she can't help but explore a bit. The nearly hour-long video was filled with atmosphere and dread as we watch Dee slowly work her way through the woods. Oh! Those eyes? Yeah! Hi. What are you saying? What the hell is that? Why are you saying hi to it? Is it following you? Still there? I can't see. Don't go there by yourself. As you can see, <sighs> two glowing eyes are shown between the trees, seemingly watching D. Then just about two minutes later, D finds herself in for yet another scare when this happens. Oh, you're leaving. I think I'm gonna stick out the field and walk up the road even though it's gonna be harder. It's cooler out here, I get more of a break. More of a break. Why, why are you going closer? Oh, what is that? What is that? Is that an animal? Is that a bear? Oh, what the? No. They're like no features either. Yeah. Oh. Dude, no! It looks like a person, man. But no person. Stop. What? It's like on all fours now again. Ah! It just keeps getting up and down, up and down. Stop! Fuck, I, can't oh my God. I thought that was something else too. <laughs> just walk, oh God, dude. So sprint out of there! What are you doing? <laughs> I'm getting so annoyed right now. A shadowy person can be seen following Dee around the forest, but thankfully she's able to get away. Sorry, this thing is following you throughout the entire time you're in the woods and you're just like walking and you're trying to talk to it. <laughs> hey, first of all, she shouldn't be there alone. Okay, we have to get that away. But this thing, I don't know. It's so, there's like no features to it besides the glowing eyes. You're literally like, <laughs> get out of there. Yeah. 